Okay, so I'm gonna call you Big AJ. Gotcha, because gotcha. because AJ is actually AJ Jr., isn't he? Yeah, but he'll be probably bigger AJ pretty soon, you know. Yeah, he's right there. He's, <laughs> he's right getting there. there. Yeah, right? Okay, yeah, I watched the, the, the cleaning and the squatting yeah, videos. Yeah, yeah. He's strong. He's Do you strong, lift man. with him the whole time? Uh, I, I, li I don't lift with them. When they're lifting, they're lifting, because otherwise I can't focus on my lifting. I'm focusing on them. You know what I'm saying? So you're double time. So, yeah, I'm double time. How do you guys, yeah. okay, how do the Ferraris end up in Texas? I got to know. Uh, Where are you guys like, from New York, originally? New York. In, in I, like, I had to know, yeah. yeah in like 98, uh, like 45 of my family members, we all moved down there. So about 98, 45 of us moved there. 40, yeah. 45 <laughs> Ferraris? Yeah, from New moved York. Moved to Allen, Texas. Yeah. Plano, and then we went Plano. to Allen. Okay, yeah. okay. So yeah. that's like desert, right? No, people think that's what I thought, but no, it's it's a suburban area. It's good cost of living. Okay. And, uh, you know, it's it's a good place to raise kids. From where in New York were you guys from? Uh, well, I was born in Yonkers, and my parents are from the Yon Yonkers in the Bronx, but we lived in, I grew up in Orange County. So do you know where that is? It's about Orange County? 60 mi no, New York. It's, okay. about, it's about 60 miles outside uh, Manhattan. Okay. All right. So you guys, and then you were in the city. I worked in the city you before worked? we moved down. Okay. Yeah, we lived in Yonkers, we moved down, yep. Okay, so was AJ in the city at no, all? Yes, he lived in Yonkers when he was a baby, but okay. all, the, all the boys were born in Texas. Okay. My oldest daughter was born in New York and went to kindergarten there. Okay, so yeah. so I, I've always wondered, I'm like, how did yeah. these yeah. seriously my Italian my people came, end up in my, Texas? Yeah, my father came down and some cousins and everybody just, you know, over a year, they came visited. It was so cheap, it was so clean and, you know, good schools. So Warm? That's how, Warm, yeah. <laughs> so that's how we ended Pretty up. Pretty nice people there. too. Yeah, Real yeah. Nice I mean, I don't, I love Northeast people too, but yeah, Northeast okay. people will tell you what they really feel. Oh, they let you know. Yeah, they I, let I, you I, know. I like that. I like yeah. that. <laughs> okay, so uh, you know when we talk, well, first off, National Middle School duels. Let's just yeah. talk about this event. Two of the three boys have wrestled here. Yeah, of, of the Ferrari yeah. boys so have I'll wrestled you, here. Let me tell you. So I, Anthony, came here in eighth grade, and uh, he didn't really, he wasn't wrestling at the right weight, first of all. But he came here, and. I think he went three and four. He came here with my wife and went three and four. And uh, my boys usually don't have a losing record or a duel. And then some other kids from Allen had come here who were, who were nationally right now, and they had really rough weekends. So my wife was supposed to come, and I said, you know what, I got to see what's going on in Ohio because obviously there's some st tough stuff going on. So this, in my opinion, is the toughest middle school duel nationally. I've been to pretty much, I've been to a lot of them. And this one, because it's not huge, I feel like, I mean, it's big, but it's not huge, so it doesn't get watered down, and you know, almost every match is is a grind. So it's it's been it's been good. Okay, so you know, this is a great tournament. You know, yeah. the boys have got one of the boys, is, uh, Anthony, has gone under five hundred here before. Right. So that's a testament to it, right? Yeah. But you know, when we talk about being the, you're the you're the father. You're AJ Ferrari's dad is what you're being known as. No dude, no one even knows you're <laughs> exactly, the right. They don't even know you're the original. Right. You're the original yeah. AJ, right? But you know, what's that like, you know, when your your dad and all this all these coaches start calling your kid and then you know they've wrestled for three different high schools, yeah. right? Yeah. What has this whole process been like for you as a dad? Uh well, wrestling wise, I mean we we didn't get into wrestling for scholarships or anything. We got into it just because to be a man. Like my kids, if you would ask them, why do you wrestle? So I could protect my family when I get married. So it was always about being tough. And then they started getting good, you know, when they were, you know, little guys, like maybe, I don't know, eight, nine, 10, 11. And, uh, you know, then you start thinking, hey, maybe we can go to college on this. Cause none of my, my kids either going to community college or they're getting a scholarship for academics or wrestling. So this is their, this is their option for my boys. You know, they're gonna get it if they can through the wrestling. So, um, but, you know, we're back home in Allen, that's home to us. You know, my, all my boys were born there. Uh, my, like I said, I got all my family there. We went back east, we're from the east. Uh, Bergen was terrific, Blair was not. Uh, so we're just uh, glad to be back in Allen. So he's been, AJ's, he's won at every level, right? Like every, all the schools he goes to, he goes to a prep school, he yeah. goes to a high school, which they wouldn't let, let him wrestle postseason yeah. jersey. Yeah. And then, you know, but, you know, he's won the Texas state title. Yeah, but, but I mean, Texas and Allen, we, we wrestled Texas districts and, you know, regionals and state, but we traveled to, you know, when we were in Allen, we were in, you know, we, we beat the Blair kid in the finals. When he, was, when he was a sophomore at yeah, Ironman. I called it. Yeah, I mean, we went to, 
we went to Reno. You know, we go to all the big tournaments. So even though we're in Texas, we rarely wrestle in Texas. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's, it's a, a national, travel. It's, it's a yeah, national it's schedule. It's a national schedule yeah. like all the two places you were. Yeah, absolutely. Other two places. Absolutely. Okay. What do you do for a living? I'm a CPA. Okay, so th- that's what I, you do. I work from home, so that's You do not I look like do. a CPA. Yeah. I got to put it out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people <laughs> want to know what this work, guy does. What does this guy do? I work from home, so that has given me the uh, the chance to be at all the kids' practices since they were little, uh, to move, even though it's been a financial beating. We, we yeah, sold the house. Yeah, I was going to ask you about we that, man. We bought a house, and we sold the house, and bought another house all within a year. And each house that we bought, we didn't even see the house. We saw it online. And we bought it that way. So uh, it's been a rough year financially. You didn't do walkthroughs? No. Well, I just sold the house last week. Yeah, I just told the, I sold the house last week. I sold one of mine. Yeah. Right? And it's like. It no, was, no, no. We did the walkthrough. It's walk an involved when process, we closed, man. When we closed, it's an involved point, process. Yeah. yeah it's right? Buying and selling, it's not easy. Like, how you're doing it, that's tough. Yeah. How you're doing it, yeah. tough. Okay. Last thing. Tom Ryan comes calling. Kale Sanderson yeah. comes calling. John Smith comes calling. You know, like all these yeah. high level, Chris Bona, whoever, right? Yeah. Head coach. Yeah. They come calling. How did you handle it as a dad? Uh, well, at first, at first, AJ didn't even have a cell phone, I believe, because he didn't get a cell phone until we moved to Blair, because I had to give him one because he was, the days there go like 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., so I had to be able to get in touch with him. So everything came through me, uh, which I thought that was a good idea, especially speaking to other dads who had been through the process. They were like, you know, let it come through you. But eventually he got a phone and, and it went through him. And every coach, I could, I could not say something bad about any of the coaches. Every coach I've spoken to has surprised me, like, in a positive way. You know, I had maybe a picture in my mind of who they were, and every coach was just a terrific guy. Uh, the way they treated us, the way they treated my son, the way they treated my wife and the other kids, just everybody was, you know, it was a difficult decision. Everybody was a great guy. So you kind of stood back. You stood back. Once yeah, you got I mean, the we phone, stood back. We went, to every, we went to every visit. And actually, we brought, like, my daughter to visits. We brought Anthony to visits, if, if whatever we could, because it was a family. It was AJ's decision, but it was a family decision. AJ's making the decision, but, you know, he's just like me. You know, I'm going to make it based on what everybody thinks around me, right? He values their opinions. Like, I tell my kids, if you're doing something and everybody who cares about you is telling you that's not a good idea, you should probably listen, right? So he made the decision, but, uh, you know, he, he heard our inputs on it, but at the end of the day, it was his decision to make. All right, last thing. How often do you hear, you're not from around here, how yeah. often do you get that in Texas? <laughs> yeah, yeah. How often do you I get that? I hear that, and I hear, I can't believe you're a CPA. Those are the <laughs> things I hear. Yeah. Awesome, man. Well, listen, so I'll see you at Iron Man. Uh, no, we're going to Reno. You're not going to Iron Man? We're going to Reno, yeah. Because I met you guys a couple years ago at yeah, Iron Man. Yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. Oh, it's crazy. Yeah, you know, it's funny. I didn't remember the face, but as we're speaking, I absolutely remember your, your voice. I got it. Well, because I got a face made for radio. Yeah. <laughs> you got a face made. I don't know. I don't look good like the uh, Ferraris, yeah. okay? All right. Hey, get in there. Watch your kid wrestle. Yeah, you got anything out. else for me? No, that's it. I appreciate it. Hey, thanks for the time. Keep grinding, all right? Yes. Thank you.